Hey, welcome back. In today's video, I'm going to take you behind the scenes of how I plan my capsule wardrobes. I'm doing the 10 by 10 petite style challenge hosted by Lavani on Instagram. Lavani is a sustainable clothing company that's launching in the spring and they create romantic pieces for petite women. I am so excited for their launch and I'm really excited to do this challenge, which anyone can join. I'll go ahead and link the details in the description bar below. But a 10 by 10 challenge where you take 10 pieces, including shoes, and you create 10 different outfits can really be fun to get your creativity going. And it's really nice to do it with others like on social media because you can see how they mix and match their pieces. So today we're gonna go ahead and pick out the 10 pieces. So we're gonna head over to my closet and then on my Instagram, I'll be posting how I style the outfits when the challenge starts January 18th. So the first item of the capsule wardrobe is actually the top that I'm wearing. I usually like to pick a few like key pieces to kind of kick off the theme and like the style of the entire capsule wardrobe. So I decided to pick this top because it looks like really fancy and classy, but it's actually quite comfortable. It's just like a cozy sweater. And I really love these type of tops for like Zoom meetings and also like video conferences because I feel really put together and appropriate for like the meeting, but I'm still very comfortable while I'm at home so I think that this is going to kind of be the theme of the entire capsule very like comfy but classy at the same time I also am going to use this blue color as the accent color of my capsule if you watched my starter capsule wardrobe video I did not too long ago I did mention that I like to have pretty much neutral colors and then I like to add one or two accent colors so I'm going with this like slate blue as the accent color Going along with that same theme, I already like have something in mind that I want to add to the capsule that's actually the same color, and it is like a, um, let's see, this little set right here. This is just a simple lounge set from Boohoo. One thing that I really love about this set is the fact that it is from the Petite Collection, and that's obviously the theme of this capsule wardrobe challenge, so I wanted to include a lot of like petite pieces, but this particular set has like wide legs, and I really love wide leg trousers, but they're really hard to find because I am so short, so I'm really glad that Boohoo had a nice selection of like wide leg lounge wear. I feel like a lounge set makes you feel really put together, but you're literally just wearing a really comfortable set and that's what I feel like this does and it goes perfectly with the theme that I'm going for with this capsule as well as the color palette. Next thing that I want to add is, okay, so now I'm trying to think about like my daily activities for the next 10 days. I know that I'm going to be doing worship and ministry most of those days, so I'm going to need some skirts and dresses. So when you're planning your capsule wardrobe, it's always good to think about what you're actually doing so that that way your capsule wardrobe fits your lifestyle and is quite practical, even if it's just for 10 days. So I do have like a, um, I think it's like, well, let me pull it out actually for you all. Here it is. Going along that slate blue line, I think this is actually supposed to be gray, but if you can tell, it looks closer to this blue, and also it's kind of in the middle of this blue and then the uh, matching set. But I want to add this. This is another like style that I feel like looks really put together, like you're about to go somewhere, but it's actually quite comfortable. And I love wearing this, especially like with a simple t-shirt. So I'm going to go ahead and add this in the capsule. This is going to be a good dress or skirt piece for ministry and worship so go ahead and add that in and now i need some tops because all i have is this top i've also noticed that all my pieces so far are like that slate blue gray color so let's incorporate some other neutral colors um i think that i'm just gonna add a simple white t-shirt it looks like i have a lot but i i really don't they're all different <laughs> some of them are just basic t-shirts others are like button downs I could include a button down if I wanted some versatility. So sometimes it's good to include a button down shirt so you can wear it different ways. But to be honest, because I want something really casual and comfortable for this capsule, I'm actually going to go ahead and go with just a simple white t-shirt. And I decided to go with this friend from Abercrombie & Fitch, which is inside out, I'm cringing on the inside. Um, but what I like about this is the fact that I could wear it multiple ways. It's quite long so I could like tie it in a knot and it's really comfortable. Like I think this is from their soft um, AF drapey collection. So it's one of my favorite pieces to wear and I think that this is gonna look really nice especially with the slate blue and kind of the gray color. So I'll go ahead and add that in there. 
Another top that I was thinking is some type of print. So right now I have blue and white, so I really do want to add some more variety with a print. And I could either go for like some stripes, like this top here, or I could do like polka dots, or even I have another top. I think you guys, I cannot put that back on the hanger. Um, this top here is like this interesting pattern with, this, this is pretty cute too, I don't know. But I think I'm actually going with the polka dot top. And I say that just because the theme of the capsule is again, like really, I'm going like with a classy kind of look and I feel like polka dots have that really feminine, classy style to them. So I'm gonna go ahead and go with the polka dotted top. This is another top that I really like to wear lately um, with working from home because it looks really put together but it's actually made of a very comfy jersey material. It's got these cute little poofy sleeves as well and I have a bunch of tops in this exact style and a bunch of different colors. So I'm going with the polka dot. I also think the polka dot is going to match well with this headband that I have. Um, actually I knew I was going to incorporate this in the capsule this is another piece that i just i love wearing this especially um for once again i keep saying it but like zoom meetings and stuff like it's like from this up that is really important so i've been loving wearing like cute little headbands and fancy little tops with um little the like sleeves like this because i feel dressed up but i'm still really comfortable so i think that this actually matches the polka dots kind of well so i'm kind of going with a the theme here so I go ahead and add that in there i still need some more dresses and skirts so i think i could either do a couple more skirts or i could do another dress and I, my dresses are over here, but to be honest, I'm kind of thinking like really comfortable and casual. So you know what I'm going to go with? My sweater dress. I think that I'm going to do the black sweater dress. So I have two sweater dresses that I really like. The first one is this cream one. I put all my sweaters in here. Most of you already know that from the other video. But um, I think I want the black to kind of keep the same color palette. This sweater dress from H&M is really comfortable. This is actually featured in my full winter capsule wardrobe. So I think that it's good to incorporate this in this smaller one just so you can see more ways to wear it. And to be honest, I've been loving wearing this, especially during the winter. I also love pairing this particular top with the headband. So that's gonna be a nice addition to add. And then another bottom or skirt piece that I am going with is my pleated skirt. So I have a really fancy pleated skirt like this. But then I have a more comfortable one. This was actually featured in my year-round capsule wardrobe, I think last year. So this one's from the Petite Collection of Abercrombie & Fitch. One thing about midi skirts is sometimes it's so hard to find a midi skirt that is the proper length um, for shorter legs. And I love that Abercrombie & Fitch has petite selections and even tall selections too. So if you have a hard time like finding pieces that are long enough, then Abercrombie also has like a tall selection. But I'm going to go ahead and add this. I actually, in this skirt, should have sized down, I think. What size did I get this in? An extra small, and I should have got it in an extra, extra small. But since quarantine, it has served me very well because the extra small is just a lot more roomy and a lot more comfortable than the uh, size down would be. So I've been pulling this out quite a lot just for how comfortable it is. But once again, we're going with the same theme here. It looks really put together with the pleated and also the fabric, but it's quite comfy thanks to the um, loose band at the waist. So now I have about seven pieces and I'm going to add just a few more. I'm going to go ahead and do my shoes. And the first shoe that I have is just these comfortable flats from Nordstrom Rack. You've seen these a few times already. I really love wearing these. And these are a good like casual but like feminine alternative. And then I just have my going out shoes, which are just my booties. Um, we've had like a really mild winter here so far. So I haven't had to pull out my winter boots only like a few times. So I've been able to just wear these because it's just been like raining. And speaking of going out, the shoes reminded me that I'm going to need uh, one more pair. I wanted to include a pair of jeans. Because of the blue and the slate blue, I actually want to incorporate a darker denim. Not black because I already have a few black pieces but probably more of, like I could go white. I think that white would be pretty nice actually to add in this too, but I think I'm just going with these jeans from Mott & Bow as my last piece. I love these 
so much. They are so comfortable. These jeans, like, I feel really sleek and put together when I put them on because they are like a skinny, darker material. But they're actually very comfortable and they're probably the closest thing to jeans I've been wearing lately. So these are definitely going to be my going out pair of jeans that I'm going to add. Now that I have all 10 items for my capsule wardrobe, I am excited to start styling them. If you want to see how I style each of the pieces into outfits, you can follow me along on Instagram because I'll be posting each outfit throughout the challenge. Don't forget to go ahead and subscribe so that that way you all can see more capsule wardrobe content and just like fashion content in general. And let me know if you plan on joining the challenge. I really hope that this video, you coming along as I plant this capsule wardrobe, can help you if you're thinking about joining the challenge or just starting a capsule wardrobe. And I cannot wait to see you all next week.